PC, you're taking a close look at remote management. Hello everyone. Today I bring you a, a rather retro piece of technology. Most of you might have used this in high school. I know I didn't. Uh, a Hewlett Packard HP 48G graphic calculator. Still in the box. Of course it's been used, but very nice. I still have the box, all the manuals. Something I picked up recently from Half Price Books. Cheap. I don't want to disclose the price, but let's say it wasn't more than five bucks. And so worth five bucks. A rundown of the information, various tables, what the calculator can do. Made in Singapore. Like most graphic calculators and graphing calculators, a lot of buttons. Just open it up right here. See here, slide everything out. It has the manual, the, the bag it came in. Everything's here. Just set the box up. Remove the plastic container, calculator, very new looking, hardly ever been used really based on the condition of it. Other piece of plastic, the, the carrying case, Hewitt Packard, little spot right there, just wipe that off, very, very minor. And here is the calculator again, and uh, the bag it came in, or the bag you're able to store it in. And it just slides right in, able to zip it up. Perfect. Keeps it nice and clean, keeps it protected. Very nice. Unzip it. Slides right out. It, that's why it has the bag. It doesn't actually have a, a plastic protective cover, so. Yeah, it's a very nice plastic covered case. On the inside, if you can see, it's that soft type uh, Velcro material that, remember the little games when you were uh, a kid? You could throw the little Velcro balls at the board on the wall? It's kind of like that. It feels like that. It's nice and soft. It, it, it would cushion the calculator. Here is all the paperwork the calculator came with. And here comes the fun part, the paperwork. HP 48 catalog of independently developed products. Various uses, books, classroom displays, math cards, navigation software, science cards, engineering software, leather case, memory cards, surveying software, and user groups, much more. I'll flip through this stuff later. Uh, envelope. I guess you can mail in the warranty information. I'll look in that later. Service plan and agreement. And the quick start guide. Basically a rundown of what it can do. And the big fella. The user's guide. Listen to that. Now I'm going to go over and review the material that came with the calculator, the catalogs, references, the user guide, and such. Here's the HP 48 catalog. And I'll just do a brief summary of each page and what it covers. Basically, this is more programming and additional stuff you could get for the calculator order forms, as well as other advertisements for stuff that Hewitt Packard was selling back then. Projectors, other calculator bags, and the prices. Name plates, stuff you could personalize the calculator with. Programming, SIM cards,
and the index for all the vendors and distributors of the products and their locations. That would be that one. And here's the envelope I think you could send the Hewitt Packard Company. And let me just open it up. It would be the registration form. That would be where F you buy the calculator. Huh. Didn't notice that. John. Huh. They already filled it out for me. So yeah, you could put all of your information, where you live, what you think of the product, a brief summary of the survey, some of the questions they most commonly would like the answer to to better understand the customer. That's that. And the low cost service agreement. Protect your investment. Gotta love that old 90's color. Turquoise and purple. Well, that gives you a rundown of the information that you'll have over an extended period of time owning the calculator. I think prices, it's a payment plan, I think, so. And service agreement, so. What you're condoning to with uh, the use of the calculator, the use of the product. There's that. And the quick start guide. Not bad. A lot of pages, but then the actual user's guide. Whew, that's thick. I'm not going to really go through all of these pages. It's more or less just how to use all of the functions and the programs and how to calculate certain equations. And then they give you diagrams of what the screen should look like and such. And a lot of information. Calculator can do hundreds of thousands of things if you if you read through all of this. It's not just adding, subtracting. There's much more. And there's that one. And the big guy. The user's guide. The Bible of the product. It breaks it down in parts, parts one through six. And again, it gives you all the all the buttons, what they mean, what they can do, how you can combine programming and functions to create equations and other programs of your own, as well as how to integrate additional programs and products into the use of the calculator for what you would be using it for. A lot of stuff, a lot of content. Very thorough. And there's that. This one. This one. This one. Envelope. And the catalog. Now for the fun part, actually getting to use a calculator and see how it works. Take it out of its pouch. And to be honest, I have not bought batteries in years, so when I got this it came with energizers, but they did not work, so I had some other batteries that, with just enough juice in them to turn on the calculator and nothing more. So. so I cannot actually give you a demonstration on some of the functions the uh, calculator is able to do, but just to get the sound of the buttons, basically an idea on what it would look like when you're using it. Not bad. And there you have it, a very thorough look at a rather older piece of 
Hewitt Packard Technology and HP 48G Graphic Calculator. Just to give you another look at the box. Very nice. Thank you and remember to stay tuned for more videos. Computer Chronicles is made possible in part by Hewlett Packard. Developing technology that lets you manage your PC from anywhere on the network, anywhere in the world. HP PC, you're taking a close look at remote management.